Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to the One Life Challenge, Part 2, where we are going to try our best to complete this challenge. So, at the moment, I have got two choices. I can either run all the way around, okay, or I can just cross the water, and that little island between me and the city is very, very important, because if you spend more than a minute in the water you are very, very likely to attract a shark, okay? So we are going to try and use that to our advantage. And, uh, yeah, swim to the island and then swim to the town. So, um, yeah. The, re the reason that I haven't uploaded a One Life... Um, come on, just swim up here. The reason I haven't uploaded a One Live video is because of what happened to me on Friday. And, uh, can you swim? There we go. I'm so. Uh, I play, my friend has been asking me to play a round of golf with him for quite a while now. And because of my 16 hour work days, I haven't really um, gotten any time, okay, to play golf or do any serious exercises. So in any case, um, we went to play golf. I haven't played golf for about five months or you know, five to four months. And... Okay, now I'm getting a little bit worried. Just want to hold in the alt key here. I think we've got about a minute here. Hey, 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 hey. What, what are you doing? Oh, shit. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Okay, so when he runs out of oxygen, when he runs out of oxygen completely, he can't swim anymore. Okay, okay, I got that. I got that. I got that. Phew. Okay, we, we're doing some close calls here. Eh? We're doing some close calls here. So let's just treat that quickly. We have to heal fully. Can't take that chance again. Okay, no, 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 no. We have to chop that into rag strips. So yeah, long story short, um, I was playing golf. And then on the seventh hole, I just, like, you know, I we didn't really warm up. That was definitely a mistake because he didn't warm up. I usually warm up, but he didn't warm up. So I just told him... Um, yeah, I don't want uh, want him or me to have any advantages, so I'm not warming up either. You know, just as a joke. Um, but in any case, so you know, I hit a few golf balls on the seventh hole. It was a par three. When I bend down to to just hit a pitching wedge shot, the, just the bending down. I didn't swing. I didn't turn my body or anything. I just, I just, I just leaned forward. To start the pitching wedge shot. Um, a massive pain went through my back. Like a, a, a shooting pain went through my back. And I collapsed on the ground. You guys won't believe me. I took about two to three minutes to get up because every time I went on my knees and my hands and I tried to lift myself up, the pain just, the pain just shot back and I was, I was back to square one. Okay. Which wasn't, uh, it was very, very painful. So, you know, I thought I just, um, pinched the nerve or something like that. And, um, got into the golf cart um, and, you know, just sat there for a little while 
told him I'm going to be all right. Um, and goodness gracious, having um, having advanced medical with other characters is major, guys. Like the fact that I have to use so many bandages for these in injuries are insane. Um, the, yeah, the medical skill makes a major difference. But in any case, um, so yeah, um, I sat in the golf cart. You know, it's only the seventh hole. We paid for 18 holes. You know, I wasn't just going to lie down and give up. So went for the eighth hole driving shot, immediately felt like even just getting out of the cart was extremely painful. And then uh, the first, yeah, I couldn't, I couldn't really like lift myself for the for the for the driver swing. You know, like normally you 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 lift your arms to the one side. I basically just had to use my arms. I couldn't really use my back at all. Um, and that carried on for about four holes of me torturing myself. And then, yeah. In at this point, it started raining, and we didn't we didn't bring our raincoats, um, so it ra you know drew, um, rained to, into the side of the cart. But you know we we don't care about stuff like that. So we got a bit wet because we saw the rain was going to stop. It was just a little shower, but we did get quite wet. And from about the eleventh hole, I couldn't bend down to put the tee in in the grass. And I couldn't bend down to get the golf ball out of the hole, like after I've putted. And I literally used my putter to lift my balls up because I just couldn't bend down. And in this process, while my clothes are wet, I literally have to go down on one knee to put my tee in. And um, in that process, because my pants were wet and because I'm so comfortable, so when I'm bending down, I'm in a very very uncomfortable position. I couldn't really control myself. So once my legs gave in because of the pain, you know, I just dropped down. And in that process, I tore my pants at the back, which my friend found very funny. I found quite funny as well. And then basically from the 13th hole, I couldn't anymore. I couldn't get out of the cart. Like um, at one point, I just tried to climb out of the cart and I just fell down to the floor because... Um, the, the pain was just too much. So after that, I just told him, okay, I can't do the rest of the hole. So I just sat in the golf cart and he, he finished the games. And then when we got out of the golf cart, um, everyone at the golf club um, was looking very funny, funnily at me because I was, I was basically walking like a, like a hundred year old man. Okay. I had my hand on my hip. I was leaning to the side because if I, if I stand up, if, if I stand up straight, um, it was just too painful. So I was leaning to the one side and um, with my back, with my back half straight and my legs bent, because if I make my legs straight, that also added to the pain. Um, and I was walking like a, you know, like a, like a grandpa. Um, that actually need, probably needed a, a stick, you know, a walking stick just to walk. Um, in any case, uh, we went into a shopping mall before we came home and um, or everyone at the shopping mall um, or not the shopping mall, like the grocery store. Everyone at the grocery store was staring at me because I was walking like half a foot every step. You know, I was, it took me very, very long to get anywhere. And then, yeah, when I got home, um, you know, I just told my friend, I'm going to, you know, I don't think I'm going to, because the next day we would have watched rugby. I told him, I don't, you know, I don't, I'll, I'll see how I feel. Um, but yeah, as soon as I, as soon as I started walking around in the house, um, I collapsed a few more times, you know, like, um, just going to the toilet was, uh, was like mission impossible. Okay. Um, um, the one life challenge hasn't got jack shit on, on me trying to go to the toilet. 
So in any case, yeah, I've been lying in bed for a little while and then just, just sitting down in front of the computer um, is quite painful. So I can't sit normally. I have to first twist my back to get my hand on the on the seat, on the arm of the seat. And then I have to use the power in my arm to lower myself into the seat. Because if I just like try to sit down normally, before long before I get to the seat, the the pain just shoots through my back and and I I give in like I I just drop down. Um. So in any case, yeah, it was quite funny on the golf course. But the main point of why I'm telling you guys this is, I've been struggling with any movement since about Friday. Um. And it's 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 great that you can use negative things to be thankful for other things. So the fact that I can't really move and I'm in pain constantly, um, I, I, I literally feel like, to give you guys an example of how bad it is, like in the war movies, you see these guys in physiotherapy or with those, you know, with two bars next to them and the, the, the nurse or the doctor just tries to let them walk a few a few steps forward. That That's about... You know that's a that's close to to how it is. Even lying in bed, I wake myself up constantly because if my body changes its position in bed, um, I shit myself basically. Okay, so the 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 two natural forms of to to treat it is rest, which I'm trying to do, um, and then you know. Therapy, which I'm not really interested 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 in, I'll rather just pray. Um, but yeah, it's it's very it's very weird to me that not weird. It's it's enlightening the things that we take for granted. Like I don't need to lose my eyesight to understand how important my eyesight is. Like some people will complain because they need to wear glasses or something like that. Your eyesight, the fact that you can talk, you know, your jaw could have been broken or there's a lot of things that can happen for you not not to be able to talk properly. Um, you know, movement, like movement. I never thought of movement. I never thought that I must be grateful for the fact that I can walk. Because we just take everything for granted. And I know I've probably been talking for almost 15 minutes now, but we, we are going to loot this down. Um, but yeah, you know, it's, it's weird how many things we take for granted. And if you really think about it, you know, like we complain about bugs in games. That's the level that we've reached. Like we pay, I, I don't know what I, I mean, I bought all the supporter packs, but let's say I paid, I don't know, $30, $40, you know, for the game and all the supporter packs. We have come to a place where we complain about small imperfections, but we don't really care about our own imperfections. You know, my, um, my dad always had a saying, First, remove the log in your own eye before you know before you try and remove the twig in someone else's eye. Um, and yeah, scum is a good example. If you look at the positives that scum is giving us, if you look at what you paid for the amount of hours that this game has given you. Complaining about anything is is it's just not a it's, it's it's not a positive mental frame of mind. It's it's not the way that we're supposed to live. Um, and I think it's it's not that we're shedding on the game or that we're complaining about the game. It's what we're doing to ourselves. So that's that's the thing that I want you guys to focus on. Humans are selfish at their core, but except for what you're doing to the outside world, having a negative persp perspective, 
um, and not uplifting everyone every day, you know, and not really having a positive effect. Um, it's more, more, you have to focus on what it's doing to you. Uh, you're not getting value out of every second that you live. You, 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 you're not, you, you're stealing happiness from yourself by looking at the negatives, um, in your life and you're ignoring all the positives like scum is a fantastic game, but we'll complain when the meta, when the metabolism system doesn't work for us, when the megs don't work right, when, you know, everything that we see wrong, we go, I don't like that. But we don't look at the, the other things that we love. If you had to mention all the things that you like about scum, it will outnumber the things that you don't like. But you focus on the things that you don't like. Just like with yourself, you, you, you focus on not having, you know, enough money, not having this, not having that. But then you, you look past the fact that you can walk and, and your health and the fact that you're here, just, just the gift of life, you know, is insane. But in any case, guys, yeah, the, the fact that I'm in pain and I can't walk is really opened up my eyes for that again and that's a good example of how you can use something negative how you can turn something negative into something positive okay now apparently this last attempt of mine was a complete fail so i'm gonna have to go for this rock okay but at least we survived it so I'm going to have to leave the shift key. I don't know why I always press the shift key. But I'm going to have to leave the shift key. I'm just holding in space bar. And then I'm scrolling the mouse wheel forward. And then I want to hold in alt. Just to look around me. But yeah, that was quite a close call. Because I was holding in shift. And I was mouse scrolling forward. Which stopped me from swimming at top speed and then you want the distance to be short enough so that you don't run out of steam that's quite important as well because when you run out of steam if you, when you run out of complete stamina you're just a floating fish you're just you're just floating shark bait which isn't really really good but in any case, I didn't think I didn't think I was taking a risk there. I thought it was a really, really good calculated risk. And I mean, I've done this before with less problems. So yeah. Hope you guys found that helpful. And I left my bow on the other side of the water. Oh my word, this is wonderful. Okay, so we're going to have to go cut down a tree. But yeah, just some food for thought, guys. Just some food for thought. Um, and hopefully... Hopefully it didn't bother the one-lifers too much. But I mean, yeah... You know, like with water, we don't really have to worry about puppets because we just lead the puppets into the water. So that's quite easy. And no, I'm not going I'm not going back to my I'm definitely not going back to my um Okay, so we're floating again. But we're moving forward slowly but surely while we're regaining our stamina if we're just holding our forward key. But yeah, I'm not going back to my bow. <laughs> Look how he's... Well, his legs are working, eh? His, his legs are working fine, man. Okay, so as you guys can see, puppets aren't a problem. And we've just replaced our shirt. Now, why not while we've got space? So yeah, our objective today is to get, uh, you know, get a backpack and um, 
you guys might have face planted there or thought to yourself what kind of stupid risks am, am i taking so early but it 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 went it went it went a bit more south than i thought it would go okay i never thought there's uh, i never thought i would give the shark enough time i have swam over that place a few times but it's small little things like that that can save you a lot of time and then the fact that you're near water okay can help you a ton as well so i'm just going to cut down the street quickly and uh, spare you the boring parts of just crafting the bow again okay we're back we can defend ourselves again and for some reason um i don't have 12 arrows which is weird okay and then we've got 12 arrows again so yes guys water is of course one way to protect yourself like i say i'm gonna take this serious um water is one way to not be killed by a puppet when a puppet runs after you like a thin one you can always jump over something and then he will trip or jump and fall okay i've literally jumped over things and then a puppet just kills himself he like jumps over things too much and just falls himself to death um, and then, of course, you know, if you do, if a puppet's behind you, this is also, you know, there's a lot of ways to protect yourself from puppets. Um, you just have to actively think about it and, um, yeah, just be aware of it. Uh, so, okay. I do need some water. But I mean, this place isn't extremely exciting, but if I can remember correctly, this place can give me a backpack. I think so. I think this place can give me a backpack. And you can use a mask for rags as well. Okay, you can't use that one. That one doesn't work. All these masks you can use for rags. Okay, so it's a very, very nice backup. Okay, so apparently these can give me something. But we're just searching through here. And I'm gonna I'm just gonna I'm not gonna really cut when I'm in a in a action-packed situation. Okay, I'm just gonna cut all the boring parts where I'm walking around. Um let's just drink this. Uh, it's better than nothing. One Okay, let's just drink one for now. Uh yeah yeah it's alcohol it's alcohol let's not let's not get drunk for now one beer is fine guys one beer is still in the legal limit anything more than that is not in the legal limit um okay so at least we know and we've reminded ourselves of everything we need to do to deal with puppets okay and we are we are working towards our target okay which is always good i hate it when i do that eh. and then if i double click on you i put you down and then i have to do this okay okay fine it's fine it's fine okay so that's working out nicely And I must say, the, the advanced style definitely helps with sound. I think I'm even searching things softer. Like, everything I'm doing with my advanced stealth sounds softer. Hey, I like. Okay, all of this is one thing. Okay, okay. No problem, dude. But yeah, we're going to loot this city, guys. We're going to loot the city. I think a lot of you remember that I have died in the city. You know, when I was chopping down the bush and I attracted them. 
But that is not going to happen again. That is not going to happen again. Why? Because I say so. That's why. Let's get into the big city. That's a nice screenshot, isn't it? Isn't that a nice screenshot, guys? I don't know. I think that's a cool, cool screenshot. Like that. Like that. Uh, why not? Pictures. Always nice to take photos, man. What the hell did I press there? Okay. Okay. There we go. Back to business. Oh, this, these stairs look cool, man. These stairs look cool. Don't like the fact that I'm in a tight space. But again, there are things to jump over, which we can remind ourselves of. There are things to jump over. We're very, very quiet. It's just sight that's not helping us. If the puppet sees us, he's still going to run at us. But we are thinking of all the ways we can survive. And we need rags. How's our food? Our food is alright for now. We don't need to stress about the food for now. We would like something to drink in the meantime. Get to our inventory. Yeah, we want a backpack. And we want something to drink. Don't we have a sewing kit yet? No, okay, okay, okay. Thread. Thread, 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 thread. Thread is still a priority. No one in here? Really? Amazing. It's amazing. Amazing. Okay, I don't think I'm going to be lucky here. This bow thing. Come on, man. Here. Yep, I know there's someone here. That, that bow thing. Okay, but you just said you're not going to focus on the bugs, Matthias. I didn't say I wasn't going to focus on the bugs. I said I was going to just focus more on the things that I'm happy about. Just going to focus more on the things that I'm happy about. Like this freaking awesome game. Okay, okay. Is this water? Drink! Hallelujah! That, so that, sounds, like, that sounds like a lot of puppets. Okay, I'm just going to drink three times. There we go. That's more than enough. Okay. And then, bam, loaded. What? Hey, hey! Oh my word! Oh my word! Okay. How do we end up here? Really, guys? Are you serious? Okay. Can we can we fall through again? We can't. Are you serious? I'm gonna log out, guys. I'm gonna log out. Okay, guys. Apparently, I'm still stuck. Um, yeah, I can't stand up again. What? What did I do now? What's that? Uh, okay, I'm not an admin on the server, 
so I'm going to have to call um, Dolls quickly. Hopefully he's still awake. Um, to come and get me out of here. So I'll be back now, okay? And yeah, I just thought about it when I was walking to make myself some coffee. If you want to, go, if you guys want to know what I look like when I walk, it's like what you look like when you walk in the dark. You know, you know the small little steps that you take when it's pitch black, you can't see in front of you. The small little steps so that you're not bump, bumping your toe into something. I walk like that, combined with a guy that's that needs the toilet really bad. Okay, so he's pinching his his butt so that you know nothing nothing happens so that the nerve isn't activated and then leaning to the one side that's what i look like if you guys can't see the humor in me getting stuck for the first time on one life talking about bugs then you need more human humor in your life <laughs> let me call those quickly Okay, guys, so Dills teleported to me, and then he just teleported me to him to get me out of there. Um, and yeah, while we're on the subject, um, if you ever want an admin to help you very, very quickly, please pick a name that's very easy for him to... Please pick a, a name without funny characters, because a lot of the times when... Um, like, I'm an admin on Survival Evolved. If if you pick a name with funny characters, then it's difficult for him to use your name to teleport to you. Okay, so please just try and pick a normal name that's easy to spell and that's quite simple to write so that if you ever get stuck, um, that he can teleport to you quite easily. Okay, um, so yeah, that's all I want to say about that. And now we can go on. Only way we're losing this character is if we die. Okay? If we die, then we'll try another build. Because I always love testing different builds. And I've got a I've got I've got quite a cool idea um, for the next build. And two nails are always important. I'm sure we all know why two nails are important for, for our chest. If we want to make a chest and hide a chest, we need two nails, okay? So nails is a must. Yeah, let's keep going. Because I logged out and logged back in, there won't be puppets in my vicinity. Some people use that to their advantage, but I don't. In any case... Let's see if we can get luckier. Let's see if we can get luckier, guys. Oh, yes, we got lucky. Oh, yes, we got lucky. Thread. Thread is priceless in this game. Priceless on the server. Oh, my freaking word. Oh, my freaking word, boys. We found a sparring bag. Fortune favors the brave, baby. Fortune favors the brave. What is up with these freaking? Am I getting a lot of these fucking crouches because I'm 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 disabled at the moment? Okay, is the is the game trying to make as many jokes as I'm trying to make about my condition? Huh? Very very funny, man. Very very funny. You you are hilarious. Okay, now now I want a puppet. Please, puppets, spawn back in. I need to kill one of you. Come on, man. Come on. If you can give me a, if you can give me the hiking backpack, this would be awesome, man. It will be awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Come on, baby. Okay, more rags is fine. Shoes, yeah, why not? Those shoes are seeing its ass. Yeah, any backpack? Okay. I'm not going to be full of nonsense like last time. You want to give me a small backpack? 
I'm not gonna pull up my nose. We'll be fine. We'll be fine. And any of you that uses this logging logging way to not have puppets in your vicinity, shame on you. Shame on you. Okay. Damn it. I think I'm too late. I think I'm too late. Where are you? Okay. I don't know. Are you stuck or not? No! No! no. <clears throat> Stole my freeing arrows, man. Bloody, bloody, bloody. Can we cut down these? Search. <gasps> really? Look at those carbs, man. And the energy's not bad either. <gasps> Guys, I've never searched these trees. Holy shit. I've never searched these trees. Holy shit, look at the spawn rate on them, man. Look at the spawn rate on them. Come on, this can't be 100% spawn rate. Holy shit, jackpot, guys. Jackpot. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, so apparently... Apparently, the spawn percentages of them are high. But not perfect. High, but not perfect. How many arrows have we got left? Six. Uh, we're good enough to utilize six arrows, aren't we, boys? We're good enough to utilize six arrows. This is a cool area. This is a cool area, man. I love exploring new places, guys. I just absolutely love exploring new places. Give me something to drink. What do I spy with my little eye? Okay, nothing. I spy nothing with my little eye. Keep pressing tab. Like this is a this is a cool variation of these buildings. You know, we know we know what these buildings are, but it's a variation of the building. Which I like. I like variations of certain buildings. Look at this nice pot plant, man. Look at that globe. That is nice, man. That is nice. If you guys ever get tired of the old, the same old boring... Yeah, this, these things are common these days. Oh, I still have to make a video to test those things. That thing. I have to remind myself that I said I was going to make a video to test it. Look at this. There's a TV here. Look at this gracious, man. I can take, I can lock up this and have my own plasma TV. Freaking excellent, man. This is freaking cool. What's that? Okay, that's the same thing. Yeah, see, this is a nice place, man. My own little box here. That's cool. That's really, really nice. Okay. Sorry, just taking a sip of my coffee, guys. Mm, we can use that. We can use that for a scope. But we need basic survival. We need basic survival or basic rifles. Oh. This place looks interesting, man. Can I have a puppet, please? Thank you very much. There we go. Now let's chop this guy up.
Now again, you guys can tell me if on One Life if you like shorter or longer videos, okay? Tell me what time you like. 20 minutes, 30 minutes, 40 minutes. Okay, down in the comments below. Type in 20 minutes, 30 minutes, or 40 minutes. Um, for all of you guys that likes the One Life, One Life videos. Now we can make that other quiver, which is cool, cool, cool. Okay. So now we can craft that quiver. Noise, 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 noise. That's good, 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 good. Good. What the hell is that? Oh, that, that's just because the meat fell into that. I just wanted to say, what have you guys been eating here in the bathroom? Does look very safe, guys. Look at this painting going on here. Goodness gracious, man. That more inventory space? That's even more inventory space. Although it's giving us a lot of heat. So I don't know if it's the best idea in the world. But we'll keep it on us. For now. For now we'll keep it on us. I like I like these variations, man. I like the variations. I like it. I like it a lot, man. I like it a lot. <sighs> Hello, sir. Bye-bye, sir. Okay, come on. Come on, we've, we've been very lucky so far, guys. We've been very, very lucky so far. Can the luck continue? Can the luck continue? Holy shit, there's so many things I don't know what to search. No, that's open. That's open. I have searched that. Okay. What's over here? Goodness gracious me. Whoa! Yes, see, you were you were fast, man. Goodness gracious, guys. That guy was a maniac. Okay, top and bottom works. Vitamin pulls, arrows, antibiotics. Okay. Late in the game, all those medicines are going to be important. But I don't feel they are important yet. Not yet. Look at all these nice pots, man. I love it. I love it. I don't like the fact that I'm not getting any backpack. But it's fine. Now that puppet definitely surprised us a little bit. So... We're just going to put our um, reaction time on level 2. Okay. And, and that's an exploder. I'm not very excited to play with an exploder. Maybe we can just trigger him. Here we go. Okay. We triggered him. So he's going to go bye-bye soon. We don't need to worry about him anymore. See if we can get some food here. Oh, our luck is starting to run out, is it? Our luck is starting to run out a bit. Our luck is starting to run out a bit. Is this the same kitchen? No, it looks like the same kitchen. Bathroom. Hey man, this place has got multiple stories. Yeah, this place has got multiple stories. So let's just check here. Okay, just be careful. Whoa. There we go, that puppet's gone. Well done, ma'am. This was a really good hiding spot. Really well done. 
That was a really, really good hiding spot you had there. Okay. Okay, your hiding spot sucks a bit. And you're a thin one. I'm going to take that ammo. If I get the point .22... If I get the point .22 rifle. We're going to level up our sniping skill, boys. We're going to level up our sniping skill. Okay. We need to focus on houses. We need to focus on houses here. We need to focus on houses. Okay. So we got rid of that exploder. Quite interested. What is up there that's so important that there's a bloody that there's a bloody exploder there? Okay, okay, okay. We're getting into the main we're getting into the thick of things here. Oh my word, a police station. Okay. Uh, we have no fear, guys. We have no fear. Because we know how to do this. Look at this police station. This police station is the cleanest police station I've seen in my life, guys. Are you going to wake up, buddy? Yeah. Okay, we're running out of arrows. The, the fact that I haven't got enough arrows... Is a bit is a little bit alarming to me. Is a little bit alarming to me. So why am I taking an unnecessary risk? My word, the, the, this this these these trees. These trees are OP. Okay, so let me. I've got I've got stealth. Let me just cut down this tree quickly. Yeah? Make sure no puppets are coming. I've got my hand on the escape key. Or I can just hold there. But I mean, escape's going to work better while I can look around me. Okay, and then I'm just going to cut this guy up. Where are you going? Okay, now I want you to go... want you to go that way, please. Thank you very much. Yeah, yo, I'm not too confident about the arrow count, guys. The arrow count isn't good, but I mean, you know, instead of chopping down multiple bushes, we're going to use our axe to our advantage. Because that's going to give us quick, quick arrows. Quick, 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 quick arrows. We can just come here, craft a few arrows quickly. Okay, there we go, we're happy with the arrow count again, we feel confident, and since we're at the police station, maybe we can get a few screwdrivers, yeah, maybe, okay, okay, that's good, I'm not interested in the rebar cutter now, but the drinking stuff is good. And I just want to see, I just want to see how, how good this thing is. Um, these stuff that we've picked up. Eat. Okay, so we're at a thousand. A thousand. Okay, that's because we drank. Okay, and our intake is 900. Goodness gracious, the intake is good. Eat. The intake is 940. 500 calories goodness freaking gracious me we've hit the jackpot boys we've hit the jackpot after more than a thousand hours it's come we are learning new stuff that is freaking epic man freaking epic dudes goodness gracious okay we're not gonna oh okay the luck is coming back can you guys feel it can you guys feel it the luck is returning to us the luck is returning to us. 
Do I want scrap metal? Oh, why not? Actually looking for uh, actually looking for a screwdriver. Uh, not we we all loot bunkers for that. We we know our main focus point here are screwdrivers. Hmm, nine nine, it's fine. Nine nine, it's fine. Okay, buddy, you have got advanced archery. You have got advanced archery. A long stick. Okay, we'll test it out now. I think I need ten uses, but I'm just gonna I'm just gonna check it out. Just gonna check it out. Whoa. Okay. I must say, those are quite easy to find, man. Those are quite easy to find. Uh, we can make a we can make a sword. We can make a sword. What do we need for the sword again? Rubber, two scrap metal, rope, and a toolbox. Two scrap metal, rope, and a toolbox. Why did you forget about the scrap metal? Why did you forget about the scrap metal? Have we got two scrap metal now? We've got two scrap metal now, okay? So that target is achieved. Now let's just quickly see. I still think I need 10 uses. But let's let's give it a go. Let's still give it a go. Yo, 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 yo. Let's see if I pick that. If I pick that, what do I need? Pick that and this and the long stick. And I pick that. And I pick this. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. And I pick that. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. 80%, 81%, yeah, they're the same durability, so I still need it. It's fine, we'll get a better wire. Holy shit. Holy shit. That is lucky loot, man. That is some lucky loot right there. Whoa. That's cool. Okay, that guy heard me. That guy heard me. We were busy with the police station. I forgot about that. We were busy with the police station. Sorry, guys. I apologize about that. I forgot about the police station. Oh, my word. Oh, my word. Okay, that's not going to fit in there, but what we can do is we can put one, two, three, four. Okay, toolbox is important. Toolbox is important for various reasons. No, we're not going to focus on that right now. Okay, let's do the police station. Let's do the police station. Sorry, guys. Sorry, 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 sorry. I just thought I'd get some... Um, I thought I'd get some screwdrivers, maybe. Okay. To pick the locks. But it's fine. Fine, it's fine. Okay. Too slow. I'm too slow. I have to go. What? One, two, three, four, five, six. This is a better police station than the usual police stations. The usual police station only has eight lockers. One, two, three, four, five, six. This one's got six lockers. Look here. Every, there's not. This, 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 this thing isn't here. The broken down table isn't here. This is bloody excellent, man. This is such a great place. Can you guys believe it? Yeah, clearly I haven't looted this town regularly. Okay, if you guys have looted this place a thousand times, good for you. Good for you. Then you listen. Then then you're exploring, which is always always great. As long as you're exploring. Okay. Okay. Okay, so that's six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Holy shit! Check all these lockers. Eleven lockers. 
This is the best police station in the world. In the world. Guys, if you know about a police station that's got more lockers than this, please tell me about it. Okay, okay. I looted that. You looted that, Drew. Don't don't freak out. You looted that. Okay? You looted that, so don't freak out. How many lockers there? Two lockers there. Oh my freaking word, this place got a lot of lockers. That place has got a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of lockers. Okay, give me that shirt. Shirt is good. Okay, come to me, bro. Thank you very much. Now you can lie down for dead. What is this? I can put locks on the cell. Hey, okay. Okay, you say so. Who am I to argue? Yeah, we don't want a ton of arrows. We don't want a ton of arrows. Can we stand up, guys? There we go. But bit risky going there for the headshot. That that's a, that's a strong dude. He'll knock my head clean off my shoulders. I'm a bit disappointed, but maybe these lockers, maybe these lockers can give us what we came for. One, two, three. No. No, they're not going to give us what we came for. And there's no backpacks in here, so that's fairly unlucky. That's fairly unlucky. But yeah, this, this, this is awesome. This is all, this is awesome, guys. It's awesome. Now I'm interested, like, is upstairs different as well? This is the best police station ever, man. What's upstairs like? Okay, upstairs is still the same boring stuff. Okay. Okay, there's food. There's food. Maybe a weapon. Oh, yeah, guys. So if you enjoyed this episode, do me a favor and smash that like button. Okay. As you guys can see, I'm not going to die. I'm not going to do anything stupid. And we are discovering some cool shit, man. We are discovering some cool shit. I think I'm going to do two more houses. Just two more houses, okay? Just quick, quick. Just quick, quick. Oh, my word. Cut up. Water for days. Water for days. 90% durability. Holy shit, man. We'll never go hungry here, boys. We will never go hungry here. Eat. Check this out. Zero intake. One piece of water. One piece of water lemon. Our food is great. Our food is great. Okay, this is going to take some time. But in any case, just hang in there with me. Look at that water, boys. Look at that water. And carbs. Carbs are good, man. Carbs are good. Carbs are good. It's a great buffer for our protein. So zero, 300. Okay, that was disappointing. That was unfortunately disappointing. I can't go with that. I can't go with so little. So I'm, prob I'm just going to drink two times out of here. That should put me close to a thousand. Yeah, 980. That is good. Now let's get back to the inventory screen. To scan this area, okay. What do you give me? I haven't eaten a tomato in a long time. Okay, so just a little lot of water, eh? 
You're not very impressive with anything else. Just a heck of a lot of water. And let's get back to the inventory screen here. Yeah? Okay. It is it is getting nighttime, guys. The video is extremely long. Again, put your comments down below. What is your perfect one life video time? Okay. What is your preferred one life video length? Put it down in the comments below. We're just going to do a quick scan here. For the backpack. For the backpack. Okay. We don't need food. We're going to do some focus looting here. <laughs> Luckily, we didn't see that ghost. That ghost didn't catch us at all. That was an epic fail ghost. That was an epic fail. And how do we get upstairs here? Okay, we just run right around the entire thing to get upstairs you know, not a big problem with that she's thin so we don't need to focus on a headshot she doesn't want to give our arrow back but we are doing some focus stuff here okay okay no you guys are gonna give me my stuff back okay let's not push Let's not let's not push the kindness too far, eh? Let's not push the kindness too far. And you little thin lady. Give me my arrow back as well. Thank you very much. Okay, so that was that's a bad house. That's a bad house. Always like these places. Man, everything's more here. All the rooms just have more. Talk about motivation to loot new places, guys. Talk about the motivation to loot new places. Like, it's not really something that I focus on. I'll check a new place once. Okay, but clearly I did not check this new place. Clearly, I did not spend a lot of time on this new place. And you other one lifers, give a give a chappy a gappy, eh? Give a chappy a gappy just to loot this place properly before you come in here with your big guns and everything. Okay. If you knew about it, then there's no motivation to come here. And if you didn't know about it, I've given you the info, but don't don't use it against me. Okay, don't use the gas. Just give me a little gap. Otherwise, I'm going to leave all the doors open, eh? You guys know me. Otherwise, I'm going to leave all the doors open. And you're going to be sorry, eh? Yep, you're going to be sorry. Okay. Come on. Come on. Oh, man. I don't need a can opener. Oh, maybe I do. Yeah, maybe I do. It, it takes less space than a knife, bro. Think about the advantages. It takes up one slot. Where the other things takes up more than one slot. You guys really like keeping my stuff, eh? Uh! Okay, so that's a better jacket. That gives me nine slots. That gives me nine slots as well. But that's cooler. Yeah, that's cooler. I'm sorry, bro. I don't need to be bright. I don't need to be a bright target. And man, are we set with food? Are we set with food? Okay, okay, okay. We we, we start we're starting to figure out the loot stuff. Yeah, I want that. I want that. Why do you want that? Why? Why do I want that, man? I want that. Where the hell did that go? I want that for that. Mm-hmm. 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 Little bit of rope, little bit of duct tape, and we can make improvised stab proof vest. That's only if we don't find the stab proof vest, okay? But you have to be creative. You have to be creative. Uh-huh. Uh -huh, yeah, yeah. You thought you you thought you were gonna stand up before I can hit you, eh? It's called shooting where you're going to be, my man. 
Not shooting where you are, shooting where you're going to be. Now let's just eat all of that. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, okay, come on, man, come on. Really, guys? Okay, yeah, okay, we've got another floor. We've got another floor, people. We've got another floor. Yeah, that's not gonna have a, that's not gonna have a backpack in it. Hello? Why is everything so freely open, man? Who looted this place? Okay. Rubber band, not important now. Needs to figuring out what we can loot. Oh, bam, 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 bam. Okay, guys. Sure, I kept you hanging, but again, put down the in the comments below what you want the video time to be. And I'll see you guys in the next episode. If you did enjoy this, do me a favor and just smash that like button. And I will see you guys in the next episode. Cheers.